Here are five brutal truths I've learned in the first 12 hours attending the biggest technology event of the year. It's called CES. It's hosted in Vegas. There's the strip behind me. And there's a ton of startups here displaying their hardware, their demos, their consumer electronics. But the brutal reality is number one, most of these startups I'm seeing are not real. Like the products are in alpha stage. They're barely working demos, sometimes scary. Like when this exoskeleton took over and was like trying to make me run. And honestly, like a lot of them are relying on Kickstarter to get funded. I'm not knocking these startups, but the reality of consumer hardware is that it's incredibly difficult to actually get a high quality product out there. People here aren't talking about risks at all. Like I was literally at this massive presentation yesterday and they're talking about Waymo and autonomous driving, which I'm very bullish in. Tesla FSD is incredible now. However, nobody's talking about that Waymo is just suspended in San Francisco because all of the self driving driving cars couldn't function when there was a power outage and the stoplights didn't work. There's very little representation from American-based startups. Um, almost every startup that I met last night is based outside of the US. Very hard to get anybody's attention if you do not have an interactive demo, okay? So there were booths that just had slides or PowerPoints and unfortunately like nobody was at those because there's nothing to play with. So it's really hard to stand out. This is supposed to be the premier technology event in the world. Yet I'm staying at an amazing hotel, but the pools are closed and they're not heated. Like, why can't we solve this problem first? I don't understand. Bonus thing I've learned is that this hotel suite is the most impressive thing I've seen at CES. And I really don't want to leave my room. I think I'm just going to binge watch Netflix tomorrow.